Thank you, Tony. The Magic kicked off their season in a dominant way Wednesday night in South Florida. But tonight, the big question, can they do it again in front of the fans at home? West Chew sports anchor Kristen Lago is live at the Kia Center, where it's an exciting time for this fan base, Kristen. Oh, yeah, guys. I think you could say it's almost like Christmas morning if you're a Magic fan. The Magic back at the Kia Center playing meaningful basketball for the first time since game six against the Cavs, and that was back in April. So naturally, there's a lot of reasons for this fan base to get excited about, especially considering what this Magic team was able to do on Wednesday night. This group showing exactly what they're capable of in game one in Miami. Their ability to play and make adjustments in the second half and sustain a lead, something we didn't always see last season. Season. They led by as many as 32 in the third quarter, led, of course, by a 33-point performance from Paolo Bancaro. That offense, especially from beyond the arc, looked much improved. And then the defense, which has been a cornerstone of this Jamal Mosley-led team, physical, aggressive, even if they were a little rusty from the jump. Now they want to repeat that and play off the energy of this home court. I think it's uh, good to play with emotion, but I think we did a great job of just staying uh, you know, having great energy, uh, but also staying even keel throughout, throughout our run and, um, you know, really didn't let up the, the whole second half. So I uh, thought it was a really good sign, but it's just one win. So, we, uh, you know, hopefully can take some of that into tonight and, um, you know, keep building. And they want to keep building against this opponent that's warming up here behind me, the Brooklyn Nets. A lot of newness for that franchise. They're led by first-year head coach Jordy Fernandez, and then gone is their star player, Mikel Bridges, who was dealt away to the Knicks during the offseason. So kind of a new team for this Magic group to take on. Tip-off for this home opener coming up at 7 p.m. Of course, I have to say, the group behind me telling me they just want to play the song and give these fans something to celebrate. We'll have more in the 6 o'clock hour, but for now, live at the Kia Center, Kristen Lago, back to you.